Mathematics is wonderful. If you know the basics of some smart things, you can actually be very, very quick in solving the questions. Look at this. 3 plus 6 plus 9. So I want to add all multiples of 3 up to any number, say 102. Now what do you do in such cases? Because they are multiples of 3, first write 3 and then if you see 102 divided by 3 is 34. So take 34, multiply it by its consecutive number 35 and divide the result by 2. Now this 2 is a fixed number. If you cancel 2 and 34, you get a 17 here and 3 times 17 is 51 multiplied by 35 will give you your answer and that is 1785. Now you can add the numbers manually and check 1785 will be the answer. Likewise, if the multiples are not uh, starting from the first multiple, like suppose you have 77 and then 84 and then 91, these are all multiples of 7, but they are starting with 77 and they go on up to say number like 287. And now I want to find the sum of these multiples of 7. So we have a 7, right? Now what do we do? If you divide 287 by 7, you get 41. So first write 41 into the next number 42 divided by 2. And now you need to subtract something from that. Which is the previous multiple before 77? It is 70, right? And 70 means 70 divided by 7 is 10. So write 10, multiply it by its consecutive number 11 and divide it by 2. And now just do this basic calculation. You will get your answer 7 times. This is 2 cancels this 21 times and this becomes 861 and this cancels 5 times. So this is 55 and your answer for the question is 7 times 806 which gives us 5642 as the answer for the question.